Hey everyone and welcome back to some more Rise of the Tomb Raider. So I just got in touch with uh, the NVIDIA people. I told them about the issue. Um, they did give me a few suggestions. They asked me to turn off the V-Sync for starters. So if any of you guys ever use a SLI setup, you may want to do this. Though I did not think that this is an adequate solution. So right now I'm actually monitoring, I don't know if you guys are going to be able to see this, I'm actually monitoring my GPU usage with the NVIDIA inspector. Uh, so as you guys can see there still is a huge stuttering which is no quite noticeable in the GPU usage. The GPU temperatures are 65 degrees centigrade and 83 degrees centigrade respectively and yeah that's about it we're gonna do i'm gonna make just one video with this on like i'm sorry to ruin the experience guys but um i hope that this will not happen if i fix this issue now this in uh sli issue this will never repeat in the future games so yeah let's continue our gameplay So we're still in pursuit of Jacob, we've completed the DLC in the previous video and yeah, Baba Yaga is free now. So she actually happened to be that Nadia girl's grandmother and yeah, that's about it. Now we're gonna follow Jacob back to his village through the mines, that's what he told us at least. Okay. So I'm getting, oh, wow, GPU usage is varying between 99% to 14%, which is absolutely bollocks. Alright, um, I'm just going to make this a very short video if I experience issues. Let's start. So, the strong box is up there, hmm. I'll get to it later then, I would like to climb up, this is by the way the Baba Yaga costume, you only, you can only unlock this once, you defeat Baba Yaga, which I've done, so, yay. So there are issues which can be clearly seen. The GB usage is varying between 12 to 90 to god knows what. I don't know why it's happening. The GPU temperatures, one of them is at 64 degrees, the other one is at 89 degrees. And at 89 degrees, the GPU is under a lot of stress. So yeah. Unfortunately, that's the case. So the lower GPU's temperature is 90 degrees, which is the max temperature it can go up to. Which kind of explains why there's Oh, so every time my one of the GPU touches 90 degrees centigrade temperature, I experience a stutter and after a while, it's stuck at 89 degrees. So once it's close to 89, like they were animals. I don't think Anna shares our faith. Or she's in this for something else. She's conflicted. I get that. I used to be the same way, but we've all got a part to play in this. Took another patrol to see if I could get another kill. Sure enough, got a remnant at the perimeter. Took my time. Did it with my hands so I could see the light in her eyes go out. It's 
stayed with her until she went cold. Magic. Mm, maybe I should put it here. Or maybe I should put it here. Right. So as you guys can see, the GPU usage is just like highly varying. Maybe you can see, maybe you cannot. I don't know. I hope you can. Anyways, I am getting close to 12 to 13 frames per second, which is very inconsistent. I think I'm gonna have to stick with using just one of the cards. That absolutely sucked. So unfortunately guys, I'm not gonna be proceeding any forward. The GPU thing has not been so still solved. It absolutely sucks and I'm not gonna be playing in such a shitty quality, you guys. It's it's disappointing. It's like extremely disappointing how certain games are so unoptimized or are doing god knows what because of which you know this is happening i hope you guys can see this i don't know if you guys can see this or not still but if you guys are seeing this you know how disappointed it would feel to be in my place right now but yeah that's about it see you next time guys bye